Assalamu alaikum viewers, I hope you are well. It's been a while since we uploaded our last video, so, so today we um, uh, come up with a, with a very quick um, and really delicious dessert recipe. So we're going to show you how to make a quick homemade dessert um, if someone come in on a short notice. It's really easy, really quickly you can make it up. Uh, and you need only very few ingredients. So today, Hani Ayman and Muhammad Aram is going to help me preparing the dessert. So for this recipe, you're going to need uh, some milk, two, two cup milk. Um, you're going to need uh, one cup of sugar. You're going to need um, one fourth of plain flour, one fourth cup of um, milk powder. You're going to need some double cream. Um, some uh, you can have rich tea um, biscuits or you can have digestive biscuits um, also some vanilla extract and some butter so let's start okay so guys we're gonna add sugar in in, in the milk and then we are gonna whisk it with the beater I find it quicker with with the beater and Arham's gonna help me with Okay guys, so now we're going to add um, some plain flour and now my baby honey is going to help me. Okay guys, so finally we're going to add some milk powder and again it's Arham's turn, so Arham's going to Okay guys, so now we are going to cook this um, milk mixture on, on a low flame and and make sure that you keep stirring um, so baby honey is going to help me cook this Okay guys, so now we're gonna need some biscuits. You can have digestive biscuits or rich tea. You are just going to line them up the base like this, like Hania's helping me and Muhammad Aram. Aram, your turn. Good. Well done. Well done. So that we can put these in the gap like this. Yes. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Okay guys, so keep stirring until you get this kind of a texture, a bit of thickness. Uh, once you get this texture, then we are going to add one spoon of butter and some vanilla extract. So here we adding one spoon of butter. And 
then half tablespoon of vanilla essence. Now keep st stirring until it gets more thicker and the butter melts down in the mixture. You can't hear the my, my children um, background noises because um, it was their bedtime so they have gone to bed so it's more peaceful now so that we can focus on this dessert. It's really quick, easy to make and you need only very few ingredients so and it tastes tastes great it tastes delicious so you must try and let me know in the comments your feedback okay guys so these this is the texture this is the thickness we need this is almost ready now so what we are going to do that we are going to pour on top of these biscuits and it's best to pour it on when it's warm when it's hot so that it can um, soft the biscuits so we are going to make a layer of this um, mixture on top of the biscuits and then one more layer of the biscuit and then another layer of um, this milky mixture okay so let's start turn off the hob and then we are going to make a layer of this mixture on top of the biscuits you can spread it across nicely So it gets into every single corner. So as you can see, I've made I've made one layer. Now I'm going to add one more layer of the rich tea biscuits on top. You can fill in any gaps later on. Any gaps in between the biscuits. Okay, as you can see, we have made one more layer of the biscuits here so we are what we are going to do that we are going to pour more milky liquid on top make one more layer of of the mixture Again, just nicely spread it across. Now that we got this ready, we are going to use some desiccated coconut to spread on top.
just a very thin layer of the desiccated coconut. Okay, so now we are going to make some cream. So first we're gonna need half cup of double cream. And then we are gonna need some icing sugar. So two tablespoon icing sugar, sugar powder. Here we are. And now we are going to whip the cream with the beta. Okay guys, so we got our whipped cream ready and we are just going to pour on top of this. Again, nicely spread it across. Okay, so now we are going to spread this across. Like a layer. So as you can see, nicely spreading it across all corners. Okay guys, so now it's ready. We nicely spread the whipped cream across and now we are going to do the garnish with more desiccated coconut. Again, just a thin layer of the desiccated coconut. Because it gives a really nice look
and some more almonds and pistachios on top. So now you must be thinking it's ready and you are right it is ready now so let me show you this is how it looks now we are going to refrigerate it for three to four hours ideally i would say best to leave it overnight and then serve it next day that's what I'm going to do, but you can, it's perfectly fine if, you know, you are, uh, you expecting someone and you're preparing it to serve the same day. So two and a half, three hours, probably max four hours should be sufficient. Okay, so now we are going to refrigerate.